Huawei continues to push the boundaries of its in-house technology, and the Huawei Mate 70 Pro Plus is no exception. Tech Insights recently conducted a detailed teardown of the newly launched handset, revealing insights into its processor, the Kirin 9020, built on 7 nanometer technology. While many expected a leap in chip manufacturing, Huawei's latest release demonstrates a focus on incremental improvements rather than groundbreaking changes. For months, rumors swirled that the Mate 70 series would feature a 5 in chip, but Huawei surprised many by sticking with its existing 7 nanometer process. Some speculated that the company might make a shift to 6 in technology, but the turnaround by Tech Insights clarified the situation. The Kirin 9020, the processor powering the Mate 70 Pro Plus, is fabricated using the 7 nanometer 7 plus 2 process similar to its predecessor, the Kirin 9010. According to Tech Insights, the Kirin 9020 represents an evolutionary step rather than a revolutionary one. Minor design changes and incremental improvements enhance its performance and efficiency without a complete overhaul. Despite these modest updates, the processor's die layout is approximately 15% larger than the Kirin 9010, suggesting room for improved capabilities. After the US imposed restrictions on Huawei, the company shifted its reliance to domestic suppliers with SMIC, Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation, playing a critical role. Like the Kirin 9000s and 9010, the Kirin 9020 is also fabricated in SMIC's foundry. Tech Insights noted that while the Kirin 9020 uses the same process technology as its predecessors, Huawei has focused on refining its SOCI designs. This approach highlights Huawei's current strategy of maximizing its resources to deliver better products within existing constraints. The consistent use of 7 nanometer technology in the Mate series, including last year's Mate 60, reflects Huawei's struggle to develop advanced chips. While competitors race towards smaller and more efficient nodes, Huawei is perfecting what it already has. This careful, iterative development enables the company to optimize performance despite limitations. The latest teardown emphasized that Huawei's achievements with the 7 nanometer Kirin 9020 are noteworthy given the sanctions. It showcases SMIC's capability to produce advanced nodes using deep ultraviolet DUV lithography equipment, which is less advanced than the extreme ultraviolet EUV technology used by global leaders. Although the Kirin 9020 represents small steps forward, Huawei is clearly charting a long-term path towards self-sufficiency. The company has eliminated dependency on foreign chipmakers, focusing instead on the domestic supply chain. This approach may take time to bear fruit, but it underscores Huawei's commitment to building a robust and independent ecosystem. Looking ahead of Huawei's advancements in chipmaking are likely to accelerate. The company's reliance on SMIC and the incremental growth in its processor designs suggest that we may see more significant breakthroughs in the coming years. Against it, Huawei's consistent progress with its 7 nanometer Kirin chips highlights that while the road to innovation may be challenging, it is far from impossible. Whether the Mate 70 Pro Plus marks the beginning of a new chapter or a continuation of steady evolution, one thing is certain, Huawei is here to stay. Stay tuned for more updates on Huawei's advancements and how they reshape the tech landscape. If you found this deep dive interesting, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for the latest in mobile technology.